Peace, y'all. My name is Marcus Singleton, a.k.a. I am Oz Barad. I'm originally from the south side of Chicago. Um, I've been living in Toronto now for almost two years. It'll be two years in July. I'm a recent graduate of University of Toronto, OISE. I completed a master's in education from the Social Justice and Education Department. Want to shout out that department. Want to shout out uh, Dr. Rosalind Hampton. I want to shout out the Black Studies cohort. I wouldn't have received the type of experience that I that I got there had it not been for Professor Hampton and the Black Studies cohort. So I just definitely got to shout them out. I just applied for the PhD program uh, in the same department. And if I get accepted into that program, my work is going to be around critical hip hop education with a focus on borders, prisons, and um, literacy. And uh, I hope y'all enjoy uh, this verse I'm about to um, breathe. Um, it's called uh, Just Me. So enjoy and uh, salute, man. Stay safe. All right? Yeah, uh, it's just me. Say, it's just me. It's just me. Hurry up, come on. It's just me. Yeah, listen, check it out. I'm the skinny version of Biggie, black or ugly as ever. However, I gotta stay righteous in my endeavors. And my only endeavor is making this life better. But that don't necessarily mean I'm chasing the paper. Cause if I had the paper, would they make me any greater than the next man standing next to me with much lesser? A man of God's eyes are much less is greater. Especially if his life is in the hand of the creator, the maker, owner, or leasing of the planet, earth, father, civilization, God of the universe. Putting things in order and it might be in reverse. The first will be last, the last will be first so in the meantime or between time i grind for the hidden treasure and not the nickel and dime making me more beautiful than my first lines because possessions mean nothing in the eyes of the sublime because it's just me yeah it's just me word up come on it's just me say what say what it's just me word up come on it's just me yeah 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 <laughs> I'm still at it. Righteous composition causing static. Deceiver still scheming, trying to alter my direction. Running in the fairness of my musical production in this game for fame, a flooded pocket net gain. Wealth ain't the only thing I'm trying to achieve, though. I'm saying something to help the chimney breathe, though. You know minorities in ghettos who ain't taught to lead. Attempts at doing this can be done, feeding my greed. Change like a fall on my way to Damascus. I'm fearless, but not careless. My words is priceless. I'm on another level. Got no peers. The evidence is clear. I breathe with no fear, only a sound mind plus power from above, and if that don't work, come up with the one to love, I work hard, work to God with supreme inspiration, but it breaks the movement, set it for damnation when we rhyme, y'all, that's how we shine, y'all, but together, man, yo, that's how we rise, come on, I said it's just we, yeah, say it. It's just we in isolation. It's just we. <laughs> it's just we. Say what? Say what? It's just we. Yeah, yo, yeah. Um, uh, um. Uh. It's just we, y'all. It's just us, y'all. It's just we, y'all. It's just us, y'all. It's just we, y'all. It's just us, y'all. It's just we, y'all. Just we, y'all. Yo, peace, y'all. Peace, y'all. P daddy 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 y'all. Say peace, y'all. Peace, y'all. P daddy 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 y'all. Say peace, y'all. Peace, y'all. P daddy 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 y'all. Say peace, y'all. Peace, y'all. Peace, y'all. Peace and blessings, man. I'm out. Salute. Hard house. Uh, for me, wellness is looking like um, doing. I'm doing a lot of reflecting, a lot of praying, a lot of journaling. Um, and just being able to like connect with my family, um, whether that's on the phone or by video or FaceTime. And, um, and it's just been a blessing, even in the crisis, it's been a blessing uh, for my wife to be able to work from home and uh, just being able to spend a lot of time with her and just have conversation and go for walks. Um, it's, been, um, it's been beautiful, man. Uh, what I rediscovered about myself is how much I love being at home. I'm a homebody. Like, I love being at home. I love um, just being in the comfort of my own space. Uh, I got a home studio here, so I'm able to, like, record and um, really just, like, be creative as much as I want. Um, so I just love being at home. It's, like, an amazing thing for me just to be at home. Uh, the one thing that I've been, well, it's two things I've been inspired by. And the first thing is um, uh, how people are being creatively resilient when it comes to connecting, like um, uh, 
just the creativity. Like I've joined a writing group, a Zoom writing group um, since you know since we've been uh, self isolating. Uh, I've I've been in a virtual birthday party. <laughs> Um, and then there's other things that's coming up. I know uh, one of the members of my um, Black Studies cohort you know, wants to plan a Netflix party. So it's, it's just been uh, beautiful to see that. Like it's been inspiring um, to see like how people are wanting to connect. Um, even though we're social isolating, um, we desire that connection with one another. And if we gotta do it through video or uh, any whatever medium we have to do it in, we're gonna do it. Um, and the other thing I've been inspired by is just um, cherishing life. Like you know, God bless to those who um, passed away during these tragic times, and God bless to their families, um, all the families out there who have lost a loved one. Um, and um, yeah, it's just been um, it's just been inspiring for me just to be. Uh, to see how fragile life is and how important it is um, for us to live our life when we have breath in our lungs, you know what I'm saying? The activity of our limbs is just to like take advantage of being able to be alive, you know? Um, so yeah, that, that's been the most inspiration for me. Like those have been the most inspiring things for me. It's just the creative resilience of people and just cherishing life while we have it because nobody's promised tomorrow and we need to cherish each day like it could be our last you know don't put off tomorrow don't put off till tomorrow what you can do today so that's been super inspiring for me so man thank y'all for this opportunity and uh salute man stay safe all right peace